cocktail, drive through, we pull the butt out the window. <laughs> they would drive through weddings, drive through parties by misfits, drive through funerals. Did y'all have that up here? Y'all had the what, what was it? Drive through film. Y'all didn't have that? Look at him. Everything I say, he act like he don't, he don't believe nothing I'm fucking saying. He would drive through films. Yes. Yeah, you. It was drive through. Well, they, listen, let me tell you what it is. It's like a Wendy's. It's like a Wendy's. You, you pull in, they, they, they prop your grandmama up in the window. You stay in your car and you pull up, you're like, ah! You got to slow, he got to slow. Uh uh. <laughs> and you drive off. And then they probably the next grab my mom and say, ah! They had to drive through strip club. Did y'all have that? Y'all didn't get that? Oh, you motherfuckers didn't live. Y'all didn't get to drive through strip club? Oh, fellas, it was so safe. It was so safe. Okay. It was so cool. You stay in your car, right? It's like a drive-in movie. You stay in your car. And you have to have a strong car. You stay in your car. And you and you bag in like in a drive through movie, right? And you're going to stay in because the, the, the strippers, they're going to jump on the hood of your car. And they're going to you gotta have a strong hood, but it was so slim. You pull back and you get your parking space, you leave your lights on, or turn them off, whatever you know you're gonna do. And then when you, you know, I call them hood technicians, because they, <laughs> they come out because <laughs> they walk in, in high heels and gravel. <laughs> They hop on your hood, right? And they be all in your, you know, all in your windshield. Be like, oh hell yeah, yeah, you safe, you're so safe. And you just looking at them, and then you turn the music up, so they dance into whatever music you know you want, like civil rights music or whatever. It is. <laughs> and they be all dancing the windshield, and real nasty ones sometimes, but they smash their ass right on the windshield. We're like, oh shit, it's like 3D ass, like, oh. And if you put your hand on that on the window, you can feel the heat sometimes. You can feel it. If you keep your hand on it, you can feel the heat on there. And you're like, oh, yeah. <laughs> and if you got a sunroof, the real nasty one, they'll sit right up there. You can look right up there. Oh, hell yeah. Look at that. Look at that. And then it was so safe. When it was time to tip them, you did not get out your car, fellas. You just roll your window down a little bit. Put the twin dollar bill in the windshield wiper and sip it over there to her. <laughs> it was so safe. It was so fun. And then for two more dollars, when you leave, Squeegee Man will get all the baby oil off your windshield. <laughs> two more dollars. Everything is not racism. I just, I just, I need to say when I see an audience this diverse, which I, I love, because you know the country trying to make you think every fucking thing is racism, and it's not. Some shit is, but everything ain't racism. That's why I like this club. When I look in this club, when I come, I it's my first time here. But I felt the first night, last night, I felt the same energy, with the same kind of collaboration of, of uh, parts of the world. <laughs> that laughter kind of, you know, it supersedes, you know, where you came from and where you look like. So that's what, one of the things I love about comedy. And and you all have you all have that in in, in this room and in, I guess in this in this town, if you will, well, in this type of town, if you're not in, <laughs> not in Aurora or whatever the fuck this. Is. But 
But sometimes this country try to make us think everything racism. It's not. Some shit is not racism. Some shit just black and white. Black and white. You got black shit, you got white shit. Now, I know it's other shades and all other kind of shit, brown people in between, but I'm saying basically you got shit, black shit, you got black and white. And we know who shit is who. Soon as you hear it, you know the black shit <laughs> from the white shit. I don't know about what, what, where you are, you, can be, you, you know right away. What's your name, Austin? Kermit. Kermit. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't have made that up. I'm not that good. Thank you, God. That's when you're living right, huh? Kermit. Hey, look, Kate. Um, you know, black people always try to give you a nickname. Hey, you know, Kate. Look, Kermit. Kermit, everything ain't racism, man. Some shit is just black and white. Kermit, shit you, you, you grew up around, shit you saw every day, things you're... Your, your parents or shit made, but you saw them do. Yeah. What's your name, bro? Tony. <laughs> With a T, right? <laughs> you saw his said, Tony. Tony, everything ain't racism, T. Some shit just what you saw, what you grew up around, you know? But we know what shit belong to you, and we know what shit belong to Kermit. We know the black shit from the white shit as soon as you fucking hear it. I'm gonna yell some shit out. You yell back at me who shit it belongs to. <laughs> Sound like fun already, huh? No. You yell back at me whether it's Kermit shit or Tony shit. Alright? Y'all got it? Y'all got it? Uh, everybody with a hand do this. Everybody with a hand. Every fucking body do it. Tap that motherfucker. Everybody. It's not a request. Do it. It's to save your fucking life. Do it. Fuck if it's the wrong gang sign. Do it. To save your fucking life. This is the official George Will going stress relieving way. So listen. I'm going to yell some shit out. You tell me if it's Kermit or if it's Tony. Now if you look like Kermit and it's your shit like him, hold up the sign with just mine. Now, if you look like Tony and it's your shit, hold up the sign we just learned. All right? Y'all got it? That's the question. Y'all got it? All right. There's a man bomber on the loose. Whose shit is that? All the white hands should be up right now, Kermit. All the white hands. Don't be slow. White people, get your fucking hand up. I said, mad bomber, you're up. Put your hands up. That's the rules. Play it with the correct way. You know that's your shit, right, white people? Mad bomber. You, you don't know that that's your shit? Y'all don't want to play this game? Is that y'all fucking telling me? White people, y'all confused about mad bomber being y'all owning the mad bomber shit? Whenever they take the motherfucker away for blowing some shit up, the Unabomber, Unabomber, it ain't never no brother, is it? It ain't never no black people, is it? No, because first of all, you gotta be on time. <laughs> You gotta be on time to even fuck with a bomb. <laughs> that rule black people out right away, go. Time bomb, nigga. That don't even go together. <laughs> you gonna trust Tony with the 830 bomb this evening? <laughs> Is that what you're telling me? It'll be eight, you gonna trust Tony with the 830 bomb. <laughs> It'll be 8.28, Tony will be on this press play. Oh, I ain't gonna make it, I ain't gonna make it. Oh. No, that's not shit, white people. Play the game right. Gold snake, gold chain snatching. Who is that? Black people, get your hands up. Get your goddamn hands up before I snatch your chain. Get it up. Black people, we know that's our shit. Black people invented gold chain snatching. They tried to get it to be an Olympic event, goddammit. It. We know that's our shit. Mass suicide, who shit? 
Get it up there. What are you hesitating for? Mass suicide. Get your, get, white people, get your hands up. Fuck, you know who the fuck mass suicide? Black people don't kill ourselves together. What the fuck you talking about? One at a time, motherfucker. One at a time. We don't play that group kill ourselves shit. It was black people with Jim Jones. Did you know that? Not one nigga died. And they had Kool-Aid. Now if you can't kill a motherfucker brother with Kool-Aid, you can't kill a brother. Black people in that house, in that house had that cup and like, uh, uh. No, I don't even fuck with on. Uh, baby, put that cup down. Get the fuck out of here. Man. <laughs> Certain things are just not in your makeup, is my point. It ain't in your DNA. Everything ain't racism. Some shit just is just not what, what you're going to do because of your, your background, your environment. Just not going to do it. Cutting off, cutting off a dick. You ain't got away, white girl. You ain't got away. Put your head down. Put your head down. The black girl that laugh at that. <laughs> but they ain't gonna cut their man dick off. <laughs> you ain't done nothing that wrong. <laughs> Give a fuck what you did, she ain't gonna cut your dick off. But she'll throw some hot grits on your ass at her. <laughs> she ain't gonna cut your dick off. <laughs> Y'all might get back together. <laughs> Black woman with a head that night would be like, motherfucker! Oh, oh you ain't shit! I'm gonna fuck your brother. I'm gonna fuck your brother. I'm gonna get you back, motherfucker. He always wanted a piece of this ass. He gonna get some of this. Topic to the women. Is it coming? Yeah, is that it, guys? I, I feel it. Like, guys, you guys want me to go there? Okay. Oh, not, oh, whoa. Okay. All right, fuck it. I told you I'd go off of, of, of what you guys sent me. All right. Okay, ladies, I'd like to speak to you uh, uh, on the topic that the men want to address, and the more is coming at me, and I, I agree with them. This is probably something that we should have addressed a long time ago, and so I would like to speak on behalf of the men in the room and abroad. Ladies, we would like to say to you, uh, collectively, <laughs> and as individuals, all of us, ladies, black and white queens of the world, we know that no decision made is a, a decision that without your input, the sun is not hot and the moon is not round without your input. <laughs> I almost forgot that part. <laughs> With that said, <laughs> the men in this room, we would like for you to please, if you will, and if you don't want to, to please suck some dick. Right, right here, you know what I mean? Over here, yes sir. Right, civil rights? Oh my god. Over here, oh my shit, in the white neighborhood too? Over here, oh, it's an epidemic, oh shit. Suck it! Get your head up, suck that strip! What is wrong with y'all? You do it! These men earned it! Man, they gave you the best years of their life, and now they can't even 